more time. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's a great day to be in the house of the Lord. We have a special celebration today as uh, we uh, welcome our Haitian brothers and sisters to us. And, uh, Pastor Pearl will be preaching. Somebody say amen to that. That's amen. A good day. And Pastor Doug, we welcome you this morning. What a wonderful day to be in the house of God. And we're going to share a meal together afterwards. That's going to be awesome, isn't it? Yes. Hey, uh, what a great month to be part of the family. If you're just joining us, you're just new to us this morning, welcome. Let us know how to pray for you and with you. A little communicator card. Last Sunday, 147 names were laid on the altar. We've been praying over those this week. That God would open a door, right? And lead somebody closer to Jesus Christ. That'd be a beautiful thing, wouldn't it? Let's stand together and please take at least five steps and say good morning to someone. Five steps. Good morning. Welcome. Five steps. Welcome. Good morning.
God says, you, Lord, reign forever. The throne endures from generation to generation. Forever he reigns.
Jesus in Christ. Let's welcome again our Tabernacle of Grace Church. Thank you. 
purchases in Christ, I ask you now to reaffirm your membership vow. Frère Maxon, moi et vous, dans Christ, moi, m'en dis-nous pour nous capables de réaffirmer vœux la foi en nous. Do you acknowledge Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, and do you believe that He saves you now? If so, answer, I do by faith. Est-ce que nous reconnaissons Jésus Christ comme Seigneur et Sauveur nous? Et est-ce que nous croyons que Il sauve nous là? Si nous, si nous croyons ça, dit oui, moi quoi? Oui, moi quoi? Do you affirm the great statement of belief of the Church of the Nazarene? If so, answer, I do. Est-ce que vous affirmez la croyance de l'Église de Nazareth là? Si oui, si oui, dit oui, moi, moi, moi fais ça. Oui, moi fais ça. Do you covenant to give yourself to the fellowship and work of God in connection with the Church of the Nazarene as set forth in the covenant of Christian conduct and the covenant of Christian character? So answer, I will. Est-ce que nous d'accord pour nous faire tête nous dans alliance avec travail ou bondié et selon l'Église Nazarene nous jamais établi caractère avec conduite chrétienne? Si oui, si oui, n'a fait ça. We Will you endeavor in every way to glorify God by a humble walk, godly conversation, and holy service by devotedly giving of your means? By faithful attendance upon the means of grace and abstaining from all evil, will you seek earnestly to perfect holiness of heart and life in the fear of the Lord? If so, answer, I will. Est-ce que nous aussi nous d'accord pour nous capables et se marcher selon en bas la grâce dans le moyen et sous présence fidèle et puis pour nous éviter tout ça qui mal? Est-ce que vous cherchez sincèrement sainteté parfaite? Therefore, by the authority entrusted me as superintendent of the Arizona District Church of the Nazarene, I hereby declare the official organization of Tabernacle Grace Church of the Nazarene. Pour que ça, selon les autorités qui confirment d'un coup et si intendant. Jusqu'à Arizona, pour les titres d'Arizona, moi, je recommande non aujourd'hui à officiellement l'église nazarienne à Ben Affleck, Casa.
for the they are this uh, endeavor of uh, I'm not good at names, but I'm a few names of uh, Louise and all the staff who were there with her. And uh, we have the best, uh, we have uh, Ralph, uh, we had a uh, Pastor Allen, which has been phenomenal throughout the years and helping us and all the music, uh, musical staff. Uh, and I thank you so much. And, and uh, also we have uh, Pastor John. Uh, <laughs> so we have Pastor John uh, who's uh, when I uh, first uh, met him, he's like, hey, you got to become the church of the national, you got to become your own church. Uh, and that was his dream, that was his goal, and then uh, it achieved, it happened uh, this day, today, and we are here celebrating this. And I think all of you are here because of your support and your, your prayers, this could not have happened because the word God says we are one man. So we all work together for something to accomplish in uh, God's kingdom. Thank you so much, uh, and uh, for all the work, and we are uh, going to continue to persevere, and until we are really one in heaven. Amen. Amen. Amen.
I spoke, and Pastor Ricardo translated, but I had so many cards, Pastor Ricardo should preach next, so give it up for Pastor Ricardo <laughs> preaching. that is attributed to King Solomon. 
And usually King Solomon usually writes Proverbs. But uh, the Bible does tell us as well that uh, he wrote more than a thousand songs. <laughs> the main idea in uh, Psalm 127, <laughs> without God is not worth it. <laughs> but when you put God where he belongs, <laughs> then you can rest in his blessing. Without God, nothing that you do has any value. The scripture tells us that uh, it's in vain. And in that uh, passage, uh, we saw vain uh, three times. So it means that it's an empty achievement. So we saw that uh, they show uh, in uh, two images. The building of a house and the guarding of a city. So we're going to focus on verse 1. So we saw that God's blessing and provision in your work. And without God, your work is in vain, brothers and sisters. And if God is not the one watching over the city, what is watching over the city is watching in vain. But it's talking about building. It's talking about guarding. So when it's when it talks about building a house, but we can use that as uh, your life. The church, your home, or anything that you are doing, you must invite God first in it. He, he must be the architect of your building. He must be the engineer of everything that you are doing. As we are gathered here today to celebrate Tabernacle with Church, without God doing it, then everything that we've been doing is in vain. As we've already a church, but we need to continue to invite God in everything that we are doing. Today opens up a new chapter in our life. And uh, that chapter needs God as much as when we needed God in the beginning and even, and even more and even more because the days are bad we have an enemy that's attacking us that does not want the church to succeed that wants us to rely on our own strength to do everything on our own. We're living in a generation that where wisdom are no more important. Discipline is no more important. Discipline The core values that our fathers or grandfathers raised us up. They become obsolete. But we know that there's one thing that cannot that can never be obsolete. It is the word of God. Once we build a foundation in the word of God, it does not pass time. It doesn't matter if we're living in the 21st century. Or we were living uh, in the first century. Or we'll be living in the 100th century. The word of God will always be relevant. It will always be powerful. 
It was 2000 years ago. C'était des mille ans de cela. That Jesus Christ died for us on the cross. Et pour Dieu est mort pour nous sur croix. And that blood et sans ça. Still saving people today. Yeah. Jusqu'à maintenant. Yeah. It is still powerful. Et il toujours des pouvoirs. It is still building people's lives. Il est toujours avec la vie du monde. Whatever a despair that you may have in your life. Quel que soit sa capacité dans la vie. Then you can look at Jesus. He can build you up. He can give you hope. He can wipe your tears away. Because he is God. He is the God of God. The King of Kings. The one they want. Whose house? On whom did you build your house? Is it in God? Is it in God? Was it God who built your house? Or is it in God who built your house? Or did you build it? Or is it in God who built your house? The relationship that you are in. The relationship you are in. The financial venture that you got into. The problem financial that you are in. The moving that you are doing. This is the placement you are doing. And any other activities in your life. Any other activity in your life. Did you invite God first? Yes, we did. We did. Because it's important to invite God. Parce qu'il est important pour nous inviter mon Dieu. We want to invite God. Nous besoin à inviter mon Dieu. In this new venture. Dans le nouveau venture ça. And because without Him, parce que sans lui-même, we couldn't be here. Nous pas d'accord avec ça. You would not know me. You would not know me. Nous pas d'accord avec moi. If it wasn't for God. Si c'est pas pour mon Dieu. Many times I could have died. En plus fois t'es capable de mourir. What God saved me. Mais bon Dieu sauvé. Because I was built on that rock. Parce que moi t'es construit sur rocher. Because when He's the one watching over me. Parce que c'est lui-même qui a gardé moi. Like He's watching over the city. Même si on a gardé la ville là. And then we are protected. Ah mais nous protégés. It wasn't too long ago. C'est là ça va être trop longtemps c'est ça. More than six years ago. Plus de six ans de ça. I was in Iraq. On était en Irak. And I was protecting the United States. On t'a protégé. My country, my fellow soldiers, my life, but you know that all the all the visions that I could have had, we went to two places to get up to the top again. It wasn't enough. It wasn't enough. It wasn't enough to protect me. It wasn't enough. 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 I was uh, working on a water pipe. When I put my hand in your ear, put it dirty. And uh, I was unloading them. When I was charging you. As soon as I'm done unloading, no. Let me charge it. And then I went about like uh, five minutes away. When we did about six minutes, six minutes this way. And then uh, I heard a uh, motor on hit. When I did, they were about to flip. When I looked over, let me get it. It was in the exact same spot where I was standing. It's the exact same place where they were taking my body. But God had only moved me. 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 But I don't. And if everybody else, they to learn one. And they call me. They only live. I was standing in the hallway talking to one of my soldiers. When they come in the corridor, they are talking with another soldier. And then when the time came up, they will hear me. Then I left. They will hear me. And as I was driving the forklift, they will hear me. And as I was driving the forklift, they will hear me. And as I was driving the forklift, they will hear me. And as I was driving the forklift, they will hear me. And as I was driving the forklift, they will hear me. And as I was driving the And when I got to where I was going, I didn't know what it was. I didn't know what it was. But when it started, all of a sudden, maybe it's a motor rock. And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there, they told me, "Let me be like you, Tim." And when I got there,
Christ when I meet on a shack or day and trip you. Yeah, but in the hallway there was none now. Mais dans les temps pour voir pas qu'il y a rien. It absorbed most of the shrub now. Ah mais c'est des mêmes qui subit tout le shrub. But had was I standing there in the hallway? Et si tu n'as pas là à pouvoir voir ça? I would not have anything to protect me. Mais tu n'as pas eu rien pour protéger. And today it could have been a different outcome. Et aujourd'hui à l'état pour l'autre bagarre. When you don't have nothing else to protect you. Donc pas qu'il y a rien pour protéger. But you have a gun. You have a God you can protect. You can protect him from the devil. That's why you can rely on him. C'est ça que vous avez besoin de même pour éviter toi à vous-même. And there is no age. Pas qu'il y a rien. There is no age. Pas qu'il y a aucun de rien à point. Ah, uh, because whatever age you are, vous allez pas pour dire votre bagarre. Then now, what are you two years old? Et quand tu sois déjà dix ans, five years old, cinq ans, ten, dix ans, twenty, vingt, fifty, sixty, soixante. You can trust in God. You can put all your trust in Him. And then uh, He will protect you. He will protect you. He will guard over you. He will guard over you. And now uh, everything that you touch is uh, will receive the favor of God. Because you are in Him. Because there is no differences between us. We are all one in Christ. He does not love me more than you. He loves all us. More more he loves us. He died for all of us on the cross. Today we may be a foreigner in this land. But one day we are expecting to go to heaven. And already while we are on this earth, in Philippians 3 verse 20, it says, but our citizenship is in heaven now. And uh, we are eagerly await a Savior day of the Lord Jesus Christ. And now uh, you know that we only have a citizenship up there. We are in Haitian. I'm American. You are American. He's Canadian. He's a Jamaican. But I'm telling you, there is a citizenship that is more superior than that. It is the heavenly citizenship. And that's the reason why TNT worked on us more than six years ago. The Church of the Nazarene welcomed us up more than six years ago. Even though we were from a different nation. But they recognized we had the same citizenship. We are brothers and sisters in Christ. Because of that citizenship that we have in heaven now. It will be far longer. Hell than the one we have on this earth. That's why we have to work for what is to come. Not for what we are seeing here. So let's love one another. Without no distinction. Let's treat one another kindly. And let's uh, encourage one another to be stronger in God. And you know that no matter what may come your way, you may be going to the school, you may be going to work, uh, to the mall, and uh, you are worried because there are a lot of shootings. But I want to tell you today, your name is written in the form of God. <laughs> there is nothing uh, that can happen to you. No one can erase it uh, because he is watching over you. And I'll close with this song. Uh, no me clean, no me
this park, and no one can kick you in if I do it. You know, they are, you are protected. May God bless you. Yes. Yes. Ricardo. 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 Uh, it's like Damn. an 